Hey guys, Jamil Zero. How you doing? I hope all is well in your part of the world. I uh, just want to make a quick video and let you know my newest small little solar project that I'm doing. And I just wanted to kind of show you guys this little project because I want you to, I want everybody to know and understand that you don't need to have thousands of dollars worth of panels and batteries and inverters and stuff like that to have cool little solar projects going on that's going to save you some money. Uh, so let me show you what I've did, or what I've done, or what I did done. Anyway, English is like my second language. I speak Hibbilanese fluently. So anyway, let's get on with it. This is uh, our one of our rabbit cages. This is a grow-out pen. You can see there we've got some mini Rexes in here right now, uh, the family unit. On the side here, that is a 12-volt DC computer fan that uh, come out of a computer. What I did was I just got some of this uh, really cheap regular speaker wire, just speaker wire for your car or for your house or whatever, just uh, the cheapest speaker wire we could get. And I wired the hot wire and the ground wire to the speaker fan. And I run my cable right now, this little speaker wire anyway. I just run it across the ground for now. And I hooked it up to this 45 watt solar panel that uh, Jeff sent to me from Missouri Wind and Solar. Uh, this solar panel um, is not a huge one, it's not an expensive one, but it's going to keep my rabbits cool uh, this summer Be uh, with just using that little fan. You can see I just got the clips clipped into the other end of the wires, the red to the positive and the, uh, the black to the negative. And they're gonna keep our bunnies cool. I'm gonna get a couple more of those fans and I will run them in series. I'll just hook the positive to the positive and the negative to the negative and run them on into the other cages. Uh, you can see we got bottles of water in there that'll circulate cooler air. Rabbits, uh, they, if they get overheated, they will uh, we'll start having issues uh, if they get overheated and they overheat really easily. So we're gonna run a series and I'll make an update video when I do that of other computer fans that are gonna be run off of the same one 45 watt panel. And uh, like I said, it's not an expensive panel. It's not a big panel. You could probably do it with a 25 or a 35 watt panel uh, and some cheap speaker wire and a computer fan that you can take out of an old computer tower or you can ask a computer repair store if they have some for dirt cheap. And you can have a cool little solar project. We're gonna put some on the chicken houses and out in the, uh, the other rabbit barn as well. Um, that way we can keep our livestock cool, cooler this summer. And, uh, and it won't cost us anything on our energy bill. So, like I said, you don't need thousands of dollars worth of panels. You don't need fancy inverters or fancy battery banks to still utilize the, uh, the, the solar power that's generated every day. Another benefit to having it straight wired like this is it doesn't run at night. Uh, in the morning when the sun comes up, the, uh, the sun hits the panel and it automatically starts to fan. And then uh, when the clouds go over and stuff, it kind of winds down a little bit. But uh, and in the evening time when the sun goes down, then it shuts completely off and it turns on automatically the next day when the sun comes up. So it's kind of like its own little timer. Uh, and uh, it's working. So there you go. I hope this helps. Uh, just wanted to show you a cute, cool little uh, solar project that uh, anybody can do. Because if I can do it, you can do it. And uh, like I said, I hope this helps someone. So thanks for watching. You have a great day. God bless. Yeah. Buzz, buzz, the end.